Conte would rather choose Tottenham Hotspur over the potential inevitable open that's going to happen at Man United sooner rather than later, then I, I'm, I'm staggered. They're going to bring Conte in who didn't want to stay at Milan because he wasn't being given assurances about how much money they'll spend. Mm. Conte that will drive them insane and it will produce the same outcome unless Petitici has got a, a different relationship with Daniel than anyone's ever had before. Because unless Conte gets exactly what he wants from Tottenham Hotspur, when he wants it, how he wants it. He stays everywhere for two years. Mm. Tottenham Hotspur are not Manchester United. They don't have the the the, the livery or the finances behind them unless there's a massive sea change. Yeah, but so Simon, if he comes and goes and he's won them something. So you're building a situation where you're dealing with the here and now. The here and now is Tottenham fans are offside. They're, they're, they're unhappy. They've built a new stadium. The, gl the gleam is coming off Tottenham. So it looks like a here and now appointment, indulging Petitici in bringing someone in that's going to either win you something and cause absolute aggravation behind the scenes or win you nothing and cause aggravation behind the scenes. Which do you want? You're going to get a bit of both, I suspect. When you're winning leagues, and you're winning leagues, and you're falling out with clubs every time you win a league because you can't have what you want next, right? How you how do you equate that to Tottenham Hotspur? Tottenham Hotspur aren't winning leagues and don't spend any money mm. of comparative significance to the other sides. How are you going to get Conte to... We, 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 we factor in what Tottenham want, but you then you take out the equation of what Man City are going to do, what Liverpool are going to do, what Man United are going to do. So if Tottenham are going to go toe-for-toe toe with those guys, bang, Conte's a football project. Do you think Tottenham are going to go toe-for-toe toe at £250 million a season with, top, with Chelsea, Man City and Man United or £150 million? Well, Conte must be saying, yeah, I can get you toe-to-toe well, to toe with these guys. If point. they're going to back him, if they're going to give him a hell of a lot of money, then I've been arguing for Conte to go into Manchester United. I cannot now not have that argument for Tottenham Hotspur. Yeah, correct. But I'm looking at the DNA of Tottenham Hotspur and saying, Daniel Levy, irrespective of devolving authority to Peratici, which he needs to do, will still have a control over the finances. And he'll say to Peratici, you can have autonomy over 50, 60, 70, 80 million quid. Yeah. But 50, 60, 70, 80 million quid isn't going to do you what Chelsea, Man City and Liverpool are doing. <laughs>